Hey everybody, Rob here for Southwest Florida Television. It's Sunday morning, a few minutes after 9 o'clock. I'm at Fort Myers Beach. I'm at Times Square, what's left of Times Square right now. This is my first visit to the island since Hurricane Ian, and it was kind of a gut-wrenching drive up here. Is just incredible. So many people working hard to rebuild Fort Myers Beach. Times Square is, has been wiped out. The pier, Fort Myers Beach Pier, gone. All the restaurants that were once thriving here are gone. This is Times Square. The buildings, the restaurants, the pier side grill there reduced to a pile of rubble. Times Square clock, the famous square clock, gone. Only remnants of a few of the buildings still left here. It's heartbreaking. Earlier this morning, I shared a link to a walk that I did here back in 2021. that so you got a reference you can go and see what this area looked like trying to make the best of it. Got a lot of food trucks and trailers all around Fort Myers Beach. I go out on the beach here and show you what's left of the Fort Myers Pier. Nothing left of Times Square. Sorry about all that wind. Nothing I can do about it. That's Margaritaville in the distance there with the crossover there, the Skywalk. Saul Margaritaville.
I'm going to take you over by the pier. Thinking about going to Sanibel Island since we're halfway there this morning. Give you a look at that. Lighthouse Beach opened up today. I don't know if we'll be able to find parking. We're going to give it a whirl. There's what's left, again, of Times Square. It's just in ruins. Can't believe the tower is still there. Flying old glory. God bless America. You can see the Matanzas Bridge in the background. Stomachs and knots walking through here. Nothing but foundations out here. once thriving restaurants here. Oh, my heart goes out to the people of Fort Myers Beach. Nothing left of the pier. The Edison House, the coral-colored building, 
hotel. Back over to the main drag. on the beach. The tears. There are so many people picking up debris, shoveling sand off the sidewalks all the way up here from Bonita Springs all the way up. gonna show you some of the shops over here. blown out. This is just a glimpse into what all of Fort Myers Beach looks like. over four months since Hurricane Ian came through here. There's a lot of, a lot of 
recovery, rebuilding, cleanup. I by the took a look at the shrimp boats. Unbelievable. It's a shrimp boat fleet. Just absolutely unbelievable. The destruction. See these huge, massive vessels piled up on top of each other. This is what you see as you drive through Fort Myers Beach. Keep these people in your thoughts and prayers. All the people whose lives have been devastated, impacted by that horrific hurricane. Look at nothing left here. I've been putting it off and putting it off coming up here, but I thought it was time to share this with you. There are some places opening up. Fort Myers Beach is coming back. It's going to be better than ever. Stronger than ever. said this is just a glimpse of what's happened here. area was bustling with tourism. Now it's pretty darn quiet.
Well, that's going to do it for my live feed here. I know it was kind of short. Like I said, we're going to try to head up to Sanibel Island. Hopefully be able to do a live feed from Sanibel. I'll get you down by the pier one last time here. awesome though the the restaurants you know they're working out of tents working out of trailers serving food doing what they can to keep people fed here as the cleanup continues hmm Amazing. Just nothing left. The water, the wind went right through this place. Back to Times Square here. What's left of Times Square? The beautiful Fort Myers Pier. that share button let everybody see what's going on here let everybody know what's happening let them know Fort Myers Beach is coming back Fort Myers Beach strong Fort Myers Beach proud if you can help out with the donation get online see who's taking donations for Fort Myers Beach. Lots of people without jobs, lots of businesses gone, lots of people without homes. A lot of folks just starting their lives from scratch. Starting all over again. Help them out.
people bringing flowers here, putting flowers at the base of the pier. Maybe I'll see you later from Sanibel Island. See if we can get out there, get a parking space and get a connection. Hey, enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong. Tally ho, my friends, tally ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.